colleagues, students, guests. Uh, I'm Art Ellis, provost here at City University of Hong Kong, and it's my pleasure to welcome you to this lecture in our distinguished lecture series. We're honored to have Professor Lauren Crabtree as our speaker for this distinguished lecture. He is Emeritus Chancellor and Distinguished Professor of History at the University of Tennessee, and Emeritus Provost Academic President at Colorado State University. Professor Crabtree earned his degrees in History and Asian Studies at the University of Minnesota. He is a specialist in 20th century Chinese history, including Sino-American relations. His administrative career is highlighted by initiatives in undergraduate education, internationalization, and interdisciplinary graduate programs. Professor Crabtree received the Colorado State University Distinguished Public Service Award earlier this year. As many of you know, Hong Kong's education system began changing about a decade ago to emphasize liberal studies in secondary schools. CityU builds on this foundation by embedding history in many of our courses and majors. We have also recently launched a new department of Chinese and history within our College of Liberal Arts and Social Sciences that along with our Chinese Civilization Center promotes the study of history. Today, we are honored to have Professor Crabtree at CityU to give us a history lesson. His talk, Echoes of 1914, This History Rhyme is Timely. We're less than a week away from November 11th, which is traditionally called Remembrance Day, among Commonwealth jurisdictions and Veterans Day in the US. And people from around the world remember the soldiers in World War I, which spanned the years 1914 to 18, along with those who were involved in many other conflicts. Even though a century has passed since the outbreak of World War I and the hostilities that began in Europe, we still face conflict and tensions throughout the world and we're forced to ask ourselves profound questions like, why are we still experiencing periods of destructive war? Have no lessons been learned? So history is a vital area of scholarship. We gain perspective by looking into the past. And I'm sure that Professor Crabtree's talk will leave us wiser and more reflective about what happened in 1914 and what's happening today in the world of international relations. So please join me in welcoming Professor Crabtree. <laughs> 